That's your winning face. I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the Constant. Yeah, he's a glorified desk clerk. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. We caught him once. We can do it again. And... Well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did, she'll make it right. She always does. We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. Miss Burnwood. How did you... I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. She came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? Are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlisle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house, meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. It began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the Constant, information that may be helpful in his recapture, so don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Thornbridge Manor. The Carlisle family's home for countless generations. The revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen.
That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carlyle this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Do we have any idea? Maybe. Command, how do you read me? Over. We've got multiple bodies. Looks like a definite homicide. I need backup. Oh, by the way, I told Kate about those texts. What did she say? Well, I thought she'd be mad at me, but she thanked me that she understood the position I was in. She never really talk about it. Oh, what did I tell you? She just said On top of everything, Rosie thinks she's in love with young Patrick. I mean, that's a breaking heart happening if I ever saw one. Poor thing. And that detective asked to come here. Madame Carlyle must believe Zachary was murdered. Ah, you must be Mr. Whitmer. So, Madame uh, Carlyle has asked me to be of assistance to you. You're American. I trust you've had a good look around. Are you ready to see the crime scene now? I bet you're a great dancer. I don't like dancing. What about restaurants? I am. Very well. If you'll follow me, sir. I feel obliged to point out the current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Madame's children were not informed until this morning that their mother was in fact not dead at all. So please bear with them if they seem affected by the rather unusual situation. I trust I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madame Carlyle is still alive. You faced great I'll consider her dead too. when I, I leave. Before we you inspect the crime scene, here. I will tell you this. It is my duty. The case concerns the death of Mr. Happen. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was found dead in his bed this morning. The door was locked from the inside, and a suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. I've prepared some information for you, so please do come and see me when you've finished your investigation of the crime scene. This is Mr. Zachary's room, to my right. A locked room murder mystery, 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. I'm really sorry, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to let you pass. Orders, you know. Asshole. You'll never come through here as long as I'm alive. Now get the fuck out of my face. As I said, I'm really... Get back to his last known position, on the double. Good man. Damn, we Looking lost track good. of the bastard. Echo Fox dropped to November Zulu. Over. Someone is causing a public commotion. I'm at the location now, and I have nothing to report. Over. Affirmative. Moving on. Out.
bitch! That's Madame Carlyle taken care of. Time to get the file on Arthur Edwards. Engage on contact! Gotcha, gotcha. Got no eyes on Tango, flush him out. Get a new visual assassin one. Stop red leader! Peculiar icons above the safe. I wonder if they might be some sort of a code. Maybe have a look around the office, 47. Mission complete. Well done, 47. Seven. They're everywhere. Go, get out! It's the Constantine! Shit! 